All right, welcome back to my let's play of Castlevania Symphony of the Night. Here on my channel, Idle Wisdom. Let's pick up again, select our destiny. <laughs> like I said last time, we're almost to the end of the game, I think. So we are here at just at the beginnings of the catacombs. Oh, that's right, yes. There's a Gaibon enemies here. <laughs> Sucks to be them. We're about to go into the catacombs, properly speaking. Right here. Here, let's get this guy. Mwah ha 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 ha. Alrighty. So let's get going. This is the last major area that we have to go in besides the reverse clock room central area where the inverse of where we fought Maria Renard in the regular castle. Ah, oh, there's the Slagra. Remember he was um, Gaibon's little buddy there in the regular castle. In the first boss encounter. Unless you uh, you unless you include <laughs> meeting with the, the with death as the first encounter, but speaking of death, this ought to be that stupid voice acting again. Let's see what they do with it. So you've made it this far. In the name of your father, cease this foolishness. Not while there is breath in my body. Then for the master, I will feast on your soul this night. Oh wow, that's pretty much the exact text. So here we are, fight against the Reaper. Uh oh, stay away. Ow, ow. We, you were indeed powerful. Now he's gonna go into his weird kooky form. I'm a Mecha Reaper with hinges and. Ow, I jumped right into that. That was really stupid. No, 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 no. Come on. No. What are you doing? Come on. Bat, fire attack. Woohoo! Ow! Come on. Aww. So much for him. What a chump. What a chump. There's chumps and then there are super chumps. The eye of Vlad. Mwahaha. Should we eh. Yeah, let's just go back out and save right quick. And we'll heal. <laughs> oh, let's see what the eye of Vlad does right quick as well. Eye of Vlad. It's the final ar um, artifact of of the treasures of Vlad. That is luck plus ten. Very good. Nice. Let's um. We'll see if we can manage this this way. Oh no. Oh here. No 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 no. Like this. So you can just no. I'm not used to the controls on this. They change it like I said last time, so that you have to hold down the trigger buttons. But still, works pretty nicely. Right past those enemies. Woohoo! Woo ha! I have to say, you know, obviously, you know, the Reaper is tough or powerful. Powerful as such. But the fact is that you gain enough power and levels and what have you that by the time you face him, 
He's kind of a chump. Kind of disappointing, really. That he's so easy. But, you know, whatever. I know he tried to stop Alucard, but he did not succeed. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, let's keep that. Alright. We need to quickly... No. Change over to PD. Instead of... Horus. Alright, PD. Go do your thing. There's something funny about that switch or that wall. Come on, yo. Ugh. Hmm. Get your butt over there. Yo, dude, for reals. Let's see if it happens if I go. <laughs> that was cool. I shot the hell up. <laughs> Alright. Ah. Was that a potion it dropped? It did. Oh, wow. Nice. Come on, dude. For real. Let's go do your job. This is what I was talking about last time I was using him in the regular castle. That sometimes he just sits there or flaps around like a dum dum. Come on, dude, go, 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 go. Please go, you little imp jackass. Let's try this. There it is. Hmm? There's a switch. Perhaps I should press it. Great work. Goodbye. Forever. <laughs> no one loves you. Die, Slagra. You don't belong in this world. <laughs> so much for you. <laughs> what a chump. Dibon's a chump. Slogger's a chump. They're all chumps. They're both chumps. We got green tea. whoop de doo Power of Sire. And a life apple. Excellent. Darn it. Mwahaha. Oh, darn. <laughs> Aww. Fall down, go boom. Ow. Oh, I screwed that all up. It wasn't as. It wouldn't have been worth it running as a dog, I, I guess, this time. Oh, well, maybe it would have. Wolf charge. It's always kind of fun. Yep, see that's all there is there. Yep, no. But you want to get that on your map. It's a decent bit of percentage of the map. And if you don't get it on both sides of the castle, that's quite a bit of map you have not uncovered and that'll probably ding you on the ending. Man, they just keep swarming. Respawning. Hmm. Oh no! Ah, I lost my darn axe. I want... 
Oh well, who cares? Maybe this will be alright. Thornweed. Hmm. So. Let's see. Ooh! The Alucard Sword. Nice. That's his mother's family heirloom sword. The Sword of Hal. Hador replaced by the Alucard Sword. Mother's family heirloom. And look at that. Oh, wait, no. Yeah, no. What? Oh, yeah. That's stronger than the... It's stronger than the Fist of Tulkis. That is incredible. No, 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 no. I did not mean to do that. <laughs> Ooh, it, it like swings with some authority. With that extra swoosh sound. <laughs> Good job, Horus. Come on, get him. Very good. Horse is like, woo-ha! <laughs> hey, what's this way? Ah, yes, the teleporter. Okay. Yes, the final teleporter. That's right. Very good. Let's continue. Continue on. <laughs> Two with one blow. Good job, Horus. Oh wait, that's not what I wanted to do. No, I wanted to go up. Whoops. It's a bat parade. <laughs> Got some weed killer here for you. We're spraying for thorn weed. Grab the shiitakes. Okay, which way first? I'm trying to remember in the... I think we should go this way first. Yes! Power of Sire. Let's actually turn back. Alright. And on we go. On we go. <laughs> this place has eerie freaking music. Boy. All right. Oh yes, that's right. No. Let's actually turn back to here. Now this area, remember we found that thing, that cat eye circlet? Let's actually equip that. Because I think this is the area where the cat eye circlet becomes helpful. At least somewhat. To, to the degree that it's helpful at all, it's here. Big heal from cat damage. <laughs> and let's just keep going. Buffalo Star. Is that it? Alrighty. Well, alright. Making progress already. You might say, look at those upside down crosses. That's just plain evil. But you have to recall, I mean, St. Peter. Oh, watch. He was crucified on an upside down cross. Okay, no. No. Okay, these... I know these witches. Look. See those cats? That normally damages you. But we get a big heal from cat damage. <laughs> P 
big, big heal from cat damage. Salome. I wonder if that's a reference to Salome from the Bible, who was Herodias's daughter. Herodias was the the wife of King of the Tetrarch, Philip, and she had divorced him and married Herod Antipas, his brother, who was another Tetrarch. Because the rulership of of Israel or Judea and the yeah, of Israel area, Palestine, Palestine, was divided up into four sections, each of them with a head. Called the Tetrarch. Okay, let's try that again. But anyways. Herodontopos was completely out of control and was basically lusting after everything that moved including his Herodias' daughter. And then his wife was Herodias. His, now, he was in trouble with John the Baptist, with the spiritual authorities, for he had broken the Mosaic Law in marrying her while his brother was still alive. Let's see. I think we need to go this way first. Oh, wow. Eh. Let's just get this. We'll try it. Why not? I I don't know. But anyways, um, and he was denounced. Both of them were denounced by John the Baptist. Oh, that's right. I don't have the. Look at this. Isn't this cool? This dude with that ice magic. The ice storm. Freaking tight. Actually, I shouldn't be attacking her. Oh wow, money, money. I should be attacking this dude. Ah! Hydra Storm! Frozen half. I guess that's what he's called, a frozen half? Okay, that's really annoying, but kind of cool looking. Thanks! No! Big heal. On cat damage. Thank you. Oh, no, I don't want that. Do not want that. Oh, look at this. <laughs> Insta-heal. You cannot hurt me. Um. Right, let's go away from that before my game glitches out entirely. Okay, did we get everything in this room? Yes, we did. Goodbye, super cat heal. <laughs> okay, let's actually um, equip our spike breaker armor. Because that is still very dangerous. Now let's do it the proper way. No, not that way. Proper way. Turn into a bat. I have tons of fun with Horus, Janine, and Casimir. <laughs> this is actually required for the best ending. Yep. If you don't do this, Alucard gets the nihilistic, like, why even live ending. He doesn't really, actually. I'm just being stupid. It is just fun. I think, anyways. <laughs> Let's equip our regular armor. A blood skeleton? There's no point really when worrying about... I think those can curse you if you don't have the proper stuff equipped, but we do. Hello, kitty. <laughs> Woohoo! Yeah! Woo ha! Karma coin, karma coin. 
Resist fire, resist thunder. Oh yeah. A red beaten bun. Nice. Come on. Horus. These like rejuvenate really quickly. There we go. That's my boy. Look how fast they recover. There's some nasty magic there. Jeez. Let me see. What is here? An elixir. Always a nice item. And a library card. <laughs> In case you need to run away. <laughs> you never know. Let's see. <laughs> That's like super fun. All right. That's good. So let's continue on. Continue on anyways. Okay, we got all the spikes, right? You don't want to touch even a single spike without the spike breaker armor on because it is some nasty damage. <laughs> okay, let's see. We'll just fly on past that one dude, the frozen half. He's kind of a pain in the neck. Unless I could just do it like this, I guess. There we go, we got him. Let's get her. Thank you. It's like, lady, why are you even trying? <laughs> Look at that cat. Stuck again. Oh, poor ass. I guess you're putting him out of his misery. That's probably nice of you. Oh, the witch is, herself is stuck. Woo-ha! Got her. We nailed her. She is toast. Kind of sad. I suppose, I guess. Whoa! There's that cool maneuver you can pull off. Alright, let's look. We need to go up this way, that's right. <laughs> Alrighty. Wooha. And wooha. Two forms of wooha. Nope, no. Let's. We're running low on magic. It's another frozen half. Man, he's weak. Dude, for real. Hehehe. <laughs> Man, dude, for reals. Should we see if we can farm a drop off of that, dude? We got a monster vial three from the skeleton. That's not really what I'm looking for. And good job. Horus. Alright, one more time, then I'll, I'll go on. <laughs> yeah, big deal. <laughs> okay, so yes, we need to go this way first, I think.
Attack potion, always nice. We'll go this way first up here and grab this. Got a shield potion. Very good. Very good. Woo ha even. And here we are. What do we get? The necklace of J. Alright, let's check out what this necklace of J actually is. I don't remember. I always remember it, but I remember it, but I don't remember what it does. Maybe we should put on our what? Yes, topaz circlet to boost our Intelligence, Dragon Helm, yes, right, that lowers intelligence. No. Noglamir, no. A defense plus 15. Necklace of J, defense plus 5, um, never mind. <laughs> um, yeah, no. Wow. Talk about a downgrade. <laughs> Blood skeletons. Come on, Alucard, get it together. Alrighty. Hmm. Let's go up here first. Yes. Okay. Just a dollar coin right there. Whoop de doo. Not at all worthwhile. Okay. Here is a safe spot, but let's just go right through here to get the treasure first. We got a diamond. Her eyes, they shone like the diamonds. And now we can save. Okay. Oof, man. So, I'm gonna try it. The boss I always have the most trouble with is right through this door. So let's, um, hmm. First, let's try getting the... I'm gonna put the, what, shield on. We're gonna use the... We're, we'll use the Alucard sword, but I want to equip the shield rod for a moment. And then equip the witch. Man, look at this terrible menu. What the hell, man? All the things to... That would boost our defense. Hmm. I think that boosts attack. That... Oh, I don't know. I can't remember. Shaman shield boosts intelligence, I know. We'll try it. We'll try the... Shaman shield or how about the goddess shield? What does that do? I don't remember what it does. No, oh, I don't remember how to do this. Oh, I don't remember. Oh, wait. Protection from dark. That is not really what I need. We're gonna need protection from thunder, but I don't know if I have anything that does protection from thunder off top of my head. Let's try the... We have oh, items that protect from thunder. Let's try the Herald Shield. Let's see what that does. <laughs> That's interesting. <laughs> Protection from fire? Really? Huh. I would have thought the Flame Shield would do that. I must have... Yeah, well, I forgot. Let's do... We'll just do the what's it call it. Alucard, no. Shaman shield. Intelligence up. Now let's go and equip our regular stuff. Let's actually equip the Alucard shield. 
because it's strong versus all attacks, and we're going to need the defense. And then equip the Alucard Sword. Oh man, I cannot find anything in this map. This map. This menu. A la carte sword. Oh, there's resist the resist thunder potions. Very useful here. I'm sorry if you see it already and I've just missed it like over and over again. I I apologize. <laughs> I cannot see things in this mini very well. Hmm. Come on, yo. Where the fluff are you? That's a la carte. Oh, there you are. My goodness, that took me way too long. <laughs> I don't know what's my problem. <laughs> I can't see, that's my problem. Apparently, in that menu. That's what I think they should have changed, not the voice acting, but whatever. Alrighty, here we go. First of all, though, let's, I should have done this. Let's equip a Resist Thunder. Yes, right here. Okay. Yeah, see that back there? It'll do lots of damage to you. This does lots of damage to you anyways. Ah, he hit me. Uh, and he can kick you like that. I always suck at this. Thank you, Horus. Get him, get him, get him, Horus. That does not do good damage to him. Jeez Louise. Now you can use this to sort of dodge that. Alucard, you utter turtle. Let's go right here. Oh, I think I got him. <laughs> no, no. Alucard. Good job. Let's um, equip. I know. Let's use another one of those right quick. And then no. Sorry for the <laughs> not very um, hmm, compelling action. I'm sorry. Let's actually equip our Alucard shield. Wherever it went. Mm -hmm. Ah, there's our high potions. We might need those for the last battle. Alucard shield, there we are. Thank you, Horus. <laughs> he loves doing that attack right there. He's pretty cool looking, ain't he, though? I always thought he was pretty cool. <laughs> Those kicks, though. Hey, 
Damn, come on. Ale um, Horace, get him. Oh, we're out of magic. Oh, it only goes so far. I forgot about that. Oh, see? It's doing more damage. <laughs> ah, quit kicking me. He's like, no. We'll use that right quick. Oh, that was not worth it. That was actually not a good idea, and I'm going to be in trouble if I don't watch it. Let's use our potions. Not our high potions, just our regular potions. We have a good number of them. This is a good position to be in right here. Relatively speaking, anyways. He has so many friggin' hit points. Get him, get him, get him. Good job, Horace. You're doing it, pal. Leave me alone. I didn't do anything to you. Secretly, I did, actually. <laughs> but, you know, don't tell him. Crap's sake, yo. Okay, dude, this is just, you know, I'm just gonna keep on dodging you. If you do that. Out of potions. Oy. Let's use these shiitakes. <laughs> this is stupid. We got him! Got him! So much for you, Thunder Demon. I think his name is Galamoth. Oh, man. Woo! Man. What a pain you are. No. Yeah. That's, in my opinion, the most aggravating boss in the whole game. Life max up. Heart max up. Hmm.
if I'm not mistaken, a really cool power-up is here. Yes. We got a ruby circlet and the gas cloud. Okay, so this is a cool power. If you look right here. Let's see, where is it? Gas cloud. Transforms into a poisonous cloud. That means you're... You see how it's yellow now? Watch. You are now a uh, lethal gas cl Oh my goodness. I'm like forgetting which button is which. You can now use the gas cloud to kill things. It's pretty tight. If you actually beat Gallimoth here before you beat um, the Beelzebub, it's actually really fun to use the gas cloud to just hover over the Lord of Flies' face or his body parts and just kill him with the, <laughs> the poisonous gas cloud. Really easy, too. It's just, he's a hard boss to beat. Gallimoth is, I think. And I always found it easier to beat Beelzebub first. So, you know, whatever. But it is kind of cool. Alright. Wow. So, that went smoother than I thought it was going to go. Took me a while, but it always takes me a while. Maybe there's a better way to do that, and I'm sure some of you know it. But I want to say thank you for joining me on this probably second to last episode of my Let's Play of Castlevania Symphony of the Night. Here on my channel, Idle Wisdom. Next time, I think all we have to do, really, is go to the cl clock room and see if we can find... Uh, hmm, yes. And I think we have to see if we can stop the, the priest shaft from resurrecting Alucard's father. But, you know, I'm sure it's... Well, I'm sure we'll get there in time. Why not? So take care, y'all.